When he was hanging out in the hole earlier, it was hilarious. Earlier, he jumped straight out. It wasn't quite that low yet, but he jumped straight out the other side. He didn't even take the step. Swinging around in the air earlier. Oh, yeah.
What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Paul. Slap no, City. go away! Slap City Slap PD! Slap City PD! You hear the, what are you the, doing? You the, I was just gonna record a video about what happened last night. Oh, what happened you hear last night? Those? What did I miss? Well, I'm, 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 I, this is a cool thing. He can tell, gonna... tell me at the same time as he right, the right. camera. I was just gonna record what happened, so. Um, last night, um, Boom just came over and brought me some deer sausage. Um, okay, so, I slept through the whole thing. I oh, was this the, the pit bull thing? Mm -mm. Oh. Oh, yeah, there's a dog missing or whatever, but, okay. yeah, there was a guy around our camp last night. I didn't hear any of this, but a guy around our camp last night was, um, screaming about his dog being gone. He was going to kill whoever had his dog, that it was his best friend. He was going to kill whoever had his dog and all of his defendants, he kept saying. He meant descendants. He kept saying defendants. Um, and he just kept saying he was going to kill their kids. And you yuppie RVers, if you got my dog, I'm going to kill you. All that kind of shit. Did you hear any of that? I heard, like, him yelling. Him yeah, yelling. Yeah. So that's the kind of shit he was saying. Also, somebody, like, reached out and... Try to open Ellen's door just to check to see like if it was open, you know, just yanked on the handle. Didn't try to like break in or anything, but did try to, did see if it was open. Then, um, comes over. I may have to edit this out because I don't want to name him by name, but someone comes over from a club nearby here. Says someone tried to break in last night. Caught him jumping the fence. Uh, he goes after him, the guy that sees him, but he didn't have his gun on him. So he shouts out to, uh... The other guy that that runs the club, and he comes out with a fifty cal and fires a shot off in the air and says, "I'm gonna fucking kill you. You're dead." That kind of stuff, right? Goes up, stabs him twice just to let him know not to kill him, but just to let him know uh, not to fuck. This with happened him. right over here. Right here, yeah. At oh, last shit. night. So yeah, dude's in the hospital right now because he just got stabbed twice. For trying to break in. Did the ambulance there. and the cops come? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, I didn't ask about that. But apparently, the guy that's been coming here taking the robot parts. You remember uh -huh. me saying that? Them two, he said that they are murderers. They decapitated somebody, and got arrested for it, and they're out of, already out of jail two days later. Okay, so this is where stuff gets really wild. I got to bust in here and do a voiceover because a lot of this story I just don't even want to put out there anymore. I put this video out about a week and a half ago and I ended up taking it down because it got a little bit of heat because I mentioned a few names. Um, I'm not going to mention any names in this video. I'm just going to uh, let some of the story be told. But I just want to tell you guys that these are not things that I've made up. They are possibly something that someone else has made up. Um, someone came to the camp telling us all these wild stories and, you know, what do you believe in Slab City? There's all this talk about murderers and vampires and all this stuff. It goes on constantly. You can't tell what's real and what's not. So I wanted to put a video out there that was a real representation of what I'd been hearing. That's why I put this video up. Um, you know, if it's going to ruffle some feathers in Slab City, so be it. I'm not out here to do that, but I'm just trying to share what I experienced out there. Now, in reality, did I experience anything close to what these stories are saying? No, I didn't. I had a great time in Slab City. So I just want to debunk any of the rumors that have been going around about, um, you know, what was contained in my video, things like that and uh, re-release this video in a more positive light. So, these are stories, people. They're stories, they're things that people say in Slab City to get a rise out of people. That's one thing that Slab City is good for, is shock value. So, take this stories <laughs> with a grain of salt, just, you know, kick back, relax, and enjoy. Um, Nobody that I know has been murdered in Slab City. Nobody that I know has experienced anything close to, um, you know, what the rumors say. So, 
I don't know. My experience has been good. And I'm just going to move on from there. So let me let the rest of this video play out. And uh, yeah. Spaceport 42. Gotta love it. What's up, Cuz? You're awesome, man. Sorry about the drama. Community Cause, everybody. Go over and check them out. Whether it's a, this is the slab's newest resident. Yeah. Yeah, he's I'm not be really stuck. leaving. I'm going to be a perma, <laughs> perma slabber. Perma slab. Perma slabber. Oh, man. Yeah. Uh, you got to uh, get that figured out. Yeah. Another That's dimension to things. That's crazy. Yeah, dude. So, yeah, yeah there was yeah, last night there was gunshots. 100 feet away. For the I just came over here for work. I can either get to work. <laughs> 